I have some crazy news. Madeline's pregnant. Like your boss, Madeline. She's not gonna take the job in Paris. Bonjour, I'm Emily Cooper. Bonjour. You lost me a bonjour. Yeah, I was told the American coming here spoke French. I did Rosetta Stone on the plane, but it hasn't kicked in yet. Bonjour, la plouc. Bonjour, la plouc. What is la plouc? La plouc, the heck. I'm very happy to have an American on my team. We will learn from each other. You were a little too friendly with Antoine. Sylvie is Antoine's mistress. Do you have any friends in Paris? No. Give me your phone. Okay, so here's my number. You're lonely, you text me, we have dinner. Oh my God, you were on Chinese Idol? We call it Chinese pop star. I thought this was my apartment fifth floor. Uh, I'm Emily. Gabriel. Nice to meet you, neighbor. Enchanté. Bones one. So how's the Paris office treating you? Oh, yeah, they're a fun bunch. You don't even bother to learn the language. You treat the city like it's your amusement park. And after a year of food, sex, wine, you'll go back from where you came. Visiting from the States. I live here now. Emily. Camille. Enchanté. So how do you like Paris so far? I like Paris, but I'm not really sure Paris likes me. I like you. Emily. Hi. Wait, this is so crazy. We keep running into each other in this neighborhood. Do you guys know each other? I really like her. She likes her too. I wouldn't have kissed you if I knew you had a girlfriend. I hope the three of us can be friends. I mean, you're gonna be friends with her, but just so you can stay close to her hot, hot boyfriend. I'm not doing that. I'm the girl who shows up, not the girl who makes bad decisions. You're not the only one making decisions here. I'm not somebody who can share a crepe. I need the whole crepe. Emily. Good night, Gabrielle. <laughs> Gabriel found the restaurant he can afford. Isn't that good news? The restaurant isn't in Paris, Emily. It's in Normandy, where it's from. It's my last night at the restaurant. And you and Camille? We will just go our own ways. In America, that's called a breakup. Yeah, we, we call it that here, too. American romantic comedies, they are so dishonest. Yeah, happy endings are very American. But they give you hope and the hero wins in the end. Hey. Oh, I thought you were leaving this morning. Antoine wants to back me in a restaurant. So you're staying in Paris? Yes. 